Hello, welcome to this tutorial on how to find antilogarithm of numbers from the antilogarithm table. So we have find the antilogarithm of 1.7139. To look for the antilogarithm of this, we look at 7139 from the table, then we now make use of this one later. So let's see how we go. Um, just like the logarithm, we look for 0.71 on the first column, which is the column of x. This is 0.71 under 3. Under this 3, it corresponds to 5164. Then the last digit, which is 9, that is difference of 9. The number that corresponds there is 11. Then we also add... 5164 plus 11. So this is 5, 7, 1, and 5. So we write it as equal to 5175. You can see I provided space between the numbers. Now we count the first digit and place the point. This is the method multiply by 10 then raise to this one we raise the 10 to this one so we now have it as 5.175 times 10 to the power of 1 then you can now write it in ordinary form that is 5.175 times 10 which gives 51.75 and that is the anti-logarithm of 1.7139 so that's it now we can write 10 raised to power 1.7139 to be equal to 51.75 we have used antilogarithm table to evaluate 10 raised to power 1.7139 to be equal to 51.75. That is the end of this tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.